Hey guys, I thought I would do a quick little video just in case some of you are still having some trouble changing PDFs to Word. All right, so I am about to share my screen with you and I'm going to go over the details of how to. Oh, I don't need that. I can minimize that. Sorry. How to transfer for a PDF to a Word document using one of our recent worksheets for ecology. This is um, heat transfer, conduction, convection, radiation. Some of you guys may remember it and how it works, but it has a PDF worksheet at the bottom. So what you do first is you click the PDF worksheet. All right, and then you have to download it. You see this download button right here? You click download or some of your computers may say save. It works exactly the same way. All right, down here it is. You see it came up down this bottom bar. Then I'm going to right click and put say uh, show in folder. OK, this is one of the ones I like to do show in folder and that'll show me my downloads folder. OK, I just click download and now I'm looking at my downloads folder and there it is. Now if it's not on the top. You see this button right here that says date modified. All right, if you click it probably twice, it'll put the most recent thing on top and that should be the thing you just downloaded. OK, so I'm all done. I've got the worksheet here in my downloads folder, so I'm done with the Internet for right now. I can close it or minimize it. All right. And now I have this. Um, this is my downloads folder. I have this heat transfer worksheet in my downloads folder. I'm going to drag it using hold down the left click button and drag this to the Miss Gales folder that I made on my desktop. OK, now if you don't know how to make a folder, you're going to um, right click to an empty space on your desktop. Say go down to where it says new. Whoops, sorry. I don't know what I just did. Oh, crapola close. Close, I don't even know what that is. OK, so what you do to make a new folder is you right click. Hit new folder. And then there it is. You put you put Miss Gales or science or ecology. If you have ecology, environmental science. If you have environmental science, just crazy old science lady, whatever you want. Your computer. I have one up here. I call it Miss Gales, so I don't need this new one. Right click delete. All right, so this is where I store everything. I've got a Miss Gales folder on my my thing, and this would be a great thing for you to have also if you don't already have it done. If you put all of my work in here, then you don't have to worry about getting it confused with your math or your history or your English. You don't have to worry about that if you have a Miss Gales folder. All right, now I've taken it out of my downloads, so I'm all done with my downloads folder. I can close it. All right, now what I have is I have a PDF sitting in my Miss Gales folder. Now we need to turn it into a Word document. So I'm going to open up Word, double click Word, and tell Word that I want a blank document. All right, once I have a blank document, I'm going to say File, Open, okay, but then I have to tell it where to go look. I want to open this folder that I just put in my Miss Gales folder, but I have to tell Word where to go look. So that's Browse down here at the bottom. Browse means go look for. All right. And I'm going to tell it I want to look in Miss Gales folder so I can use this side column. And I can find the folder that says Miss Gales, so double click it. And there is my worksheet on the very top. Again, if it's not on the top like you want it, click the date modified button twice and it'll put the newest stuff on top and then double click it. All right, tell the computer. Yes, I want you to convert it. And then say yes, enable editing. And now you should be able to click it and start typing right there on it. Okay. Now, once you have it filled out, you need to click save. Do not use the auto save, it'll mess you up every time. Okay. Do not use that auto save. Okay. Just click the regular save. You see this box? Or you can click under file save. You can do file save, or you can click this box. OK, now you want to tell it, put it back. Make sure you're putting it back in the Miss Gales folder. OK, and hit save. Once you have it done, you can close it there and go back to Schoology. Go back to the day that I assigned it. Right here. And there should be up in this top corner a submission button. So you click submission and you put it in there. See, I've got some kids with their work submitted already. 
All right, that should be how you get that done. And if you have any questions, just send me a remind. Hit it me and remind it. I can help work this out for you. All right. Bye, everybody. See you in class. Let me see. Stop the recording. Bye.